टूडे वी लर्न हाउ टू डिफाइन लॉड कॉम्बिनेशन ऑटोमेटिकली एंड मैनुअली बिफोर वी स्टार्ट हाउ टू क्रिएट लॉड कॉम्बिनेशन इन स्टेट प्रो फर्स्ट वी अंडरस्टैंड वट इज द लॉड कॉम्बिनेशन एंड वाई वी एनालाइज ए स्ट्रक्चर विद डिफरेंट लॉड कॉम्बिनेशन एग्जाम्पल इफ ए बिल्डिंग वी डिजाइन ओनली कंसिडर द डेड लॉड and the live load when come like human or furniture or other live load come the structure is collapsed because it is designed only for dead load that's why we take the combination the combination why we use combination is very easy to understand uh, means if the uh, body have a dead load the cell fit we also add live load human and furniture and other and that time also earthquake come or wind load come so we want to uh, our structure will stand under the dead load live load wind load and earthquake load and other load that's why we analyze the structure or we want to uh, we want our structure is safe under the uh, uh, any condition any condition means under the any combination uh, when dead load and live load only Uh, uh, apply uh, or uh, consider when earthquake come, when earthquake and wind load come. So that's why we take the load combination. Okay, one more thing we can uh, we don't uh, uh, take combination of earthquake load and live load. Earthquake load, sorry, earthquake load plus wind load, because we consider when earthquake is come, wind is not come. the at that maximum pressure that's why we don't take the combination if we take the combination building is very expensive if we can take the both combination okay so that's why we take the load combination now the question is arise why we take the factor of safety we know that factor what is factor of safety we design if uh, a structure for 100 kilo newton and by accidentally 20 kilo newton uh, also come some from somewhere uh, now the load is 120 structure if that's why we take a safer side and we take a factor of safety but 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 the question is that why we take different different load combination like if we consider a structure only dead load and live load sorry dead load and live load so what are the combination uh, according to is code 1.5 dead load plus live load second is 1.2 dead load plus live load and third is 1.5 dead load and fourth is 0.9 dead load the important question is arise when the structure is safe for 1.5 times of the dead load plus live load so why we analyze also in these combination why this is the question because like a uh, example of overturning uh, overturning of a building mm, sorry like this overturning of building the heavy building is less possibility to the light building for overturning understand if we take two buildings under the earthquake or under other loads a one building is heavy and other is light there is possibility of light building to overturn so that's why we analyze also light load means 0.9 dead load 0.9 into dead load one more thing because dead load when earthquake is come and building is going to overturn the uh, dead load is help to this resist this effect so how much dead load is help that is the 0.9 of dead load not fully that's why we also analyze uh, with the less factor of safety combination if you 
explain more easy and or more correct way please comment uh, uh, under the description this video and the question is that why we use why we use 0.9 factor of safety for dead load okay so these are the load combination how to create load combination in the stat pro let's start hello everyone welcome to the stat pro basic to advanced full course tutorial series let's start so first of all we make a building a small uh, okay we make a small structure like a frame now the we apply fix support at the bottom and the next step is define properties we take rectangular section of cross section of rectangle square shape assign both same property of the column and beam again after that we apply to load in this video we create load commission on between only with the only dead load and live load not earthquake load because as, uh, in this series stat pro full course series uh, is not started and not uh, make video on the earthquake or wind load that's why we learn today only how to create load combination with dead load and wind sorry live load same as we apply in the when the, we have more loads other than loads of wind load and dead load add dead load dad dead load and other load add is live load live okay only live in dead load we consider only self weight and live load we consider a udl load of minus 10 assign to view okay okay by mistakenly, I am also apply this UDL to column. How to remove this load from column? Go to the toggle load and use cursor and assign. Click on column and the load is removed. Now we have to make load combination. IS456, I, I, according to IS456, we have four load combination 1.5 dead load plus live load 1.2 dead load plus live load 1.5 dead load and 1.2 sorry 0 0.9 dead load okay we create this four combination with the help of automatically and manually so click on the load case where we create load case click on the load case rail add and you see here some options go to the define combination and auto load combination first we create by auto Take, okay this sorry first we create by uh, manually go to the define combination first combination we create here you see the num load number is three because we have two load also and the load number 3 is 1.5 dead load plus live load bracket close it only this is only title now what we do we remove this both load here because we need required both load for this combination by the double arrow okay we put here the factor of safety 1.5 both load case have load have 1.5 and click on add you check here one load combination is created okay next load combination is 1.2 dead load plus live load now you we have we require only two loads dead load and live loads here so that's why we select this load and from by the one arrow we move this load and put factor of safety is 1.2 and click on add second load combination is also create now third load combination is 1.5 dead load only so what we do we require only dead load so that's why we move only dead load 
and port factor of safety 1.5 at next load combination is 0 0.9 dead load we require dead load move and power put factor of safety 0 0.9 and add close the four combination is created one two three and four now what we do we analyze and check the effect of this combination done what we do go to the post processing we also check shear force bending moment diagram here but we don't uh, app, we don't check the value of the load so value of the load we go to the post processing done this is the band deflection mm, this is the deflection icon when we click on deflection deflection is appear but very small difference that's why uh, we are not able to see if you want to uh, enhance the a deflection profile what we do we press the control button of the keyboard and move the uh, and rotate the squirrel now we enhance the diagram of deflection uh, now what we want we want the deflection value here to so go to the result to view value beam result and check mark the maximum result and rotate close this is the def deflection 6.052 mm here is this here in this due to due to this deflection due to live load this is the live load now wh what we do we change here from dead load this is the deflection due to dead load and this is the deflection due to combination the maximum deflection we know that uh, um, occurred due to this load ok check 11.054 1.2 is 8 and 9 point is it is ok envelope is more thing is the uh, is envelope means we create an envelope we in the envelope we mm, add the all loads and check the result by the summation of all load but to, in this video we don't create the envelope that's why no result is found so you can change here deflection this is the deflection now click on the bending diagram also you enhance the diagram by press the control and scroll the mouse you can change the scale of the diagram and you can go to the result uh, value and uncheck the displacement check the bending moment and rotate and you can see the result by the different load combination same you can check the shear force and enhance the diagram by this same and this is the uh, load combination created by the stat pro now you can also check the uh, you can play the video of animation animated video of the deflection go to this icon click on deflection and ok this is the deflection you see is minor deflection due to 1.2 and this is 1 due to 1.5 ok so this is all about how to create load combination what is load combination and how to create manually now what we do we delete this load combination ok so you see here here is clearly the title of the load combination is clear we have like 1.5 developed live load ok you remember this why we talk about this now we uh, create load combination by automatic click on load case and add and go to the auto load combination and select indian code general structure of steel general and generate ok this is the four load combination ok how to read this one means this one means number one load combination and this one means load number one first one means okay we explain in detail first load combination write this one dots one one point five zero then two then one point five okay this is the this okay this one means the load combination is one first load combination this one means this is the dead load load one this 1.50 means factor of safety this load combination means this two number two is means live load and 1.5 is load factor of safety the meaning of this line is load combination one and the factor of safety is 1.5 bracket dead load plus live load when you 
make automatically then the title of the load comments is different but the meaning is same okay same as last last one you check four means fourth load combination one means dead load and 0 0.9 is factor safety if you click add the all four load combination generated and you can analyze and check the result okay this is the all about the load combination how to create manually and automatically if you like this video please share like and subscribe and also click on the bell icon why bell icon because if you click bell icon you get the notification of the future video if you're not interested in stat pro then if the futures um, uh, are features uh, tutorial series on etap sap ansys abacus autocad revit 3d max if you Mm, click on bell icon you get the notification of this tutorial series that's why mm, you click on the bell icon and please comment and share if anything wrong in this video and if you know better than me uh, why we use 0 0.9 load combi load combi load factor of safety on dead load please comment uh, we display this comment on the next video thank you